Hey you, welcome to the team. So newbie, what is your power? We all have powers. That's why we're here in Blue Lock. We're special in our own ways and, well, we're here to find out who's the best striker and in order to form a good team, we need to know your strengths and weaknesses so we can develop a strategy. When I mean we, I mean Isagi. Isagi's power is that he can predict where the ball's going to be. He can see plans and formations in his brilliant mind of his. It's pretty cool. I don't know how he does it, but it's been very useful for the team. He always knows where the ball is going to be, who's going to get the ball, who's going to score. It's pretty useful. My power is speed. Some people call me the panther, and some people call me the princess of speed, so... Yes. Or some people jeer at me because they can't catch up to me and call me Missy. That doesn't matter, though. I am above all of that. What team were you on before? Okay. Yeah, I can work with that. So, just to get you acquainted with everybody on our team, we have Baro and, uh, or Baru. Honestly, I don't really care, but he calls himself the king of the field, aka a ball hog. Yeah. And he's weirdly, like, clean? gets mad at me all the time for having hair on the shower or or like leaving my robe on the floor it's kind of kind of dumb like we're dudes right like relax a little mess is okay yeah so what do we go over me Baru did we talk about Nagi Yes, the prodigy. This guy. Always on his phone. Playing games, being lazy, forgetting when to eat. Complaining when things are too hot or cold and, you know. Yeah. He joined Blue Log with his friend because his friend dragged him into playing soccer. And he ended up having, like, natural talent. You know, I'm ashamed to admit that, sure, the guy is very lazy, but even I can't question his talent is, is definitely there. You know, he's only been playing soccer for like two to three months before joining Blue Lock. How does someone do that? I've been playing ever since I was very young. And even then, no one could catch up to me. All right, well... Enough introductions and whatnot. You want to play soccer? Do you have the ball? Cool. Yeah, we can dribble it around and see how well you do. Give me the ball. Sorry, give me the ball. Okay. Yeah, it's right over there. Okay. Um, first of all, we do not pass to the hands. This is soccer. We do not use our hands unless you're the goalie. Do you want to be the goalie? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Blue Lock programmed these cool, like, bots to be the goalie. So you can shine as the striker that you are. But <laughs> sorry, I'm going to be the best striker. All right, let's see what you got. All right. Good. Well. We could work with you. It seems like you'll fit into our team quite nicely. With Isagi, you know, doing his little voodoo brain magic. I think we'll definitely go far. We'll definitely win tonight's match. Yeah. All right. Well, 
Might as well go get some food, rest, and get ready for the game. Let's go. Okay, the game's about to start. Did everybody hydrate? Make sure you have enough water intaked. Newbie, did you drink your water? I knew you didn't. Stop looking so nervous. Drink your water. And I'll drink mine. Mm. Okay, did everybody go over a soggy strategy? I will be flitting back and forth on this soccer field, and you will look for an opportunity to pass to me. You can make it go as far as you want, because I am super fast and I will get to the ball, okay? Yes, Barra will be standing on defense right there. Yep, and Isagi will look for any opportunity and figure out where we'll all be. So everybody just play and look for cues. Okay, good. Nagi's kind of a wild card. You just keep being you, Nagi. All right. Do you hear the crowd? Doesn't it just pump you up? You ready? Come on, it'll be fun. I mean, we'll only get eliminated, or at least one of us will get to move on, but we'll only get eliminated if we lose. Yeah, I'm joking, but not really. So, take it seriously, okay? It's time to go in. Oh my god, are you okay? Medic? Medic? Hello? We have a player down. Oh my gosh. You are losing color in your face. Okay. Okay. Spider-Man. Medic. Where are they? Okay, they issued a red card that was completely just terrible. Like that ball just landed under your foot and it made you trip. Do you remember? You can hear me, right? Do you know who I am? Say my name. Say my name, say my name. If no one is around you, even if they are. Okay, so. Please, uh, look at this light. <sighs> Seriously, I'm not even, like, paying attention to us. It's a good thing they leave this kit around, so at least I can do something about it. You know, being someone that has had a knee injury before and an ACL tear, um, you know what, out of everybody here on this team, I'm your best hope. So, let's go ahead and... Okay, looks like you are aware and you are responsive, so that's a good thing. Just, uh, does this hurt at all? Okay, nothing hurts. Let me just like grab your arm. Okay, nothing over there. No. Good. Good? Okay, so here is the spot that I'm kind of afraid to touch. So I'm going to work on the other leg first, okay? Any pain? Ooh, okay. Penis in this leg. What leg is that? Your right leg. 
left leg. That's the left leg. Sorry, I don't know my lefts and rights. Okay, so your left leg is in pain right now, and, uh, okay, you did kind of scrape it pretty bad, so we're, we're going to need to cleanse the area. Where is that? Give me the first aid kit. Nagi, come on. Stop being lazy. You can't just lay on the bench. Give it to me. Nagi, am I right? Have your first aid, sterile gauze. Okay, we have everything that we need here. Okay, I'm going to put on these gloves because, well, unfortunately, newbie, you have some blood, which is just lovely. And as awesome as I am, I don't want to be touching your blood. Okay, so. Oh, don't worry. I've wrapped my own leg many times, and uh, <laughs> it's almost muscle memory at this rate. Okay, now I just need that to dry. Give it a few seconds. going to put a band-aid on the most immediate area. It's just a scrape. Thankfully we don't need any stitches and it doesn't seem like you broke any bones. You might have just uh, hurt it mildly. It's going to hurt right now a lot but it doesn't look that bad. After a few days you should be good as new. Now I'm going to tie it with some gauze. Yeah, the gauze would stop any other bleeding that I can't uh, get with that band-aid. So there is a spot that I haven't touched yet. Um, it looks like it's already bruising. Does that part hurt at all? I'm going to just make sure and use some Biofreeze on it, okay? This is a numbing spray. It's going to help with any of that pain that you might be feeling. Yeah, they have like menthol and, and, and whatnot. It helps relieve any like tingles that you may be feeling right there. So. I use it all the time for my knees. <laughs> you don't always feel it, but sometimes every now and then you feel a twinge of something, so this comes with my personal stash. Okay, I'm gonna wrap it all up with sports tape. This is going to make sure that you don't move that area around, like your ankle. It's very important that we firm that area up with the sports tape. That sports tape's pretty cool, and the fact that it doesn't stick to the skin, but only sticks to each other, so... It's one of my favorite tools to use, or bandages, so to speak. Good. Okay, I know I checked to see if your cranial nerves are okay, and if you can see me, and... If anything else is damaged, well, I just want to make double short. You see this? How do you feel? Are you dizzy at all? Good. Okay, looks like you're okay there. And 
I know it's your legs that are hurting, but let's check the reflexes of your arms, okay? Don't really use it uh, during soccer, but you did land on your elbow as you went down, so I just want to make sure that both these areas are okay too. Okay, good. Nice movement. Okay, good. Your arms are okay. All right. Thankfully, you seem okay overall. Um, let's get some Tylenol. Extra strength on you. Okay, I think two should do it. So they are. Okay. And the other one. Here's some water. Do you mind if I take a sip? Like, I'm... I ran here right away and... I actually could use some water. Thanks, man. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. I just want to double check a few more things. Could you open your mouth, please? Say, ah. Good. Ooh. Sometimes when you get injured there could be bleeding in the ears i'm just going to check real quick just for peace of mind since again the medic doesn't seem to be caring or doing their job good good all right i think i did a pretty good job you seem okay if anything you can go to the infirmary or you can sit and watch the rest of the game because we actually need two more goals before we win, officially. We should be okay without you for now. Um, what can I say? Our team's pretty talented, right? So just relax on the bench and uh, watch us do some magic, all right? Hey teammate, before you go sit down on that bench, actually, you get a penalty kick. So I know your right leg is the dominant foot that you use. Do you think you'll be able to use your left leg to do one of the penalty kicks? Because then we'll only need one more goal. All right. Good luck. Oh my gosh, you made it. I knew we can count on you. Welcome to the team, man. Yeah, now you can just sit back and relax as the rest of your team just tries to get that one more goal. We got this. For sure. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'm sure Isagi has already made a very good plan. Okay, well... Wish us luck. Cheers on. <sighs> you did it. <sighs> you won. Hey, teammate. We won. We move on. I wonder what else Blue Lock has left in store for us. Yeah, you're pretty cool. Penalty kick with the left leg. <laughs> Who would have thought? Well, I do hope you heal up soon. <sighs> I mean, with my pro skills, he'll be healed in no time. <sighs> yeah. Catch you later. <laughs> 